Hey, what's up everyone? I want to give you a quick little update, one year update review of my MSI GL75 Leopard laptop. Um, this is not going to be a very technical review because I am not a tech nerd, but I am a power user of the laptop. Um, kind of the reasons why I bought it. The specs of mine has the Core i7 chip and the GeForce GTX uh, graphics card. It's a dedicated graphics card. It's not sharing, uh, not integrated graphics. Um, I bought this one because I am a video editor, I'm a content creator, and I wanted, this is a gaming laptop, but a lot of content creation and gaming, they have a lot of the same hardware needs. So a game, you know, buying a gaming laptop kind of made sense for me because, uh, especially this one, because this one actually made sense for the money. It was, uh, it was relatively inexpensive compared to a dedicated office machine. And, uh, the reason why I went with the MSI is because MSI is built for serviceability. If I want to upgrade my graphics card, I can. I can actually flip this over. And there's a, there's a, you can open this up and you can actually change out your graphics card. Um, most laptops are not built that. Most laptops are built as sealed units. They're built as they're built and you really can't mod or tinker with them or, or service them. This is. This is built with serviceability in mind. And pretty much everything from MSI is built that way, which is why I liked it. Um, I cannot say what I paid for it, but it is a very reasonably re priced laptop. Uh, again, for the money, what you get. Um, as a again, as a content creator, I like the cooler boost on, which I thought was kind of a gimmick when I bought it. But this does get hot as I'm creating. It's a little button here on the side. All I have to do here is hit that little button, and you'll hear the fans will start to run. Basically, a, there, there's two fans on the side here. This will cool this off. I, it'll, it'll, it'll go from really, really warm to normal temperature in about 30 seconds as long as I run that little cooler boost. It sounded like a gimmick at first, but I actually use that fairly often um, when I am running a lot of video editing software on my machine. Uh, the gaming mode is kind of cool. I, I occasionally game. This was more of a bonus for me. I didn't buy it because of gaming mode, but essentially I pop it into gaming mode and then I get this nice little RGB display. Goes into there. And I think it starts to, not overclock, but it starts to use the... Uh, you know, it kicks up the processor into a higher gear. So I'm gaming. I'm not going to have any much lag. But again, I am not a gamer. I am a video editor, so I seldom use gaming mode. Oh, wait. Let me just go through there. There we go. Eh, whatever. I'll, I'll turn that off later. Um, either way, I'm happy with the laptop. For a year, I've never had a problem with it. It's always been... Uh, it's never overheated. I've never gotten a blue screen. I've never been in a situation with this particular setup. And... Uh, where I've been like, man, I wish I got the next level up. This is all the laptop that I need. And again, I am a full-time YouTuber, content creator, video editor. Um, as an office machine, as a content creator, this is the perfect machine. This is all you need.